Hi everybody, did you have fun doing your warm-ups? Did you go like around like a ballerina or up on your tippy toes? This is so much fun. Relaxing way to move, but very good for you as well. You can do a, lot, a long time of warm-ups every day if you wanted to, but it's also important to get that heart rate up. So I'm gonna show you what we can do, but you have to get something. You need to go get a towel like this one, beach towel or just a regular towel. Let me place it to where you can see it on the video. And I want you to also get a laundry basket like this one that has clothes in, or I just put a blanket in mine. And one more thing I need you to get right now is make sure you have some water to drink. Very important to drink some water before, during, and after your workout. Okay, so what I want you to do is stand on the other side of the towel. And I do want you to tell you that this room is kind of a small space, yes. So hopefully you will remember to have a large enough space free of obstacles, you don't want you to get hurt and bump into anything. So here we go. You're gonna jump over the towel and back. If you can't jump backwards, go ahead and turn around and go the other way. Or you can come back far in the room and you can run and jump over it. So much fun. Let's do it again. Let's, let's do it with one foot now. I'm kind of like galloping, actually galloping like a horse. Now you could also stand at the side of your towel and see if you can jump across your towel this way. And then the more arms and legs that you move, the faster your heart will start to get up and that will be very good for your heart. One more thing we can do is jump and stop in the middle of your towel, ready? Jump. Now you're gonna jump with both legs, each leg touching the floor, ready, go. Now go back to the towel, go back to the sides of the carpet, and back to the towel. You know what that is? That's the beginning of a jumping jack. So let's add the arms. Out with your arms, in with your arms. Out and in. Let's count to five, okay? Starting now. One, two, three, four, high and you could also make your arms go up high so you can go out up high and out and down low out up high and out now go ahead and try to do some let me watch you Let's see if you can do some all right good job doing those jumping jacks and exercising very good now get your laundry basket with the laundry basket, I'm just going to move my towel. So you can do that for five minutes or ten minutes. The scientists do say that if you exercise your heart just over ten minutes, you're doing your heart some really good. So with your laundry basket, have it down, and you're going to bend those knees. You're going to pick up the laundry basket, and then you're going to put it back down on the floor and stand back up. This is a house, house job or a chore, but you can exercise while you do it. You can have proper form. That's proper form means the way you bend so you don't get hurt. And sometimes we still get hurt even when we're adults. We forget to use proper form. So let's do that again. Let's do five of them, okay? One, and back down. Back up. Two. This is like squats. Three. Now we're on four. And five. Here we go. Good job. Good job doing that. And I want to show you one more thing, or two more things actually. We are going to do a few sit ups for our core muscles. So, what I would like for you to do is Get down and see me. And you can have a parent or somebody hold your feet down while you're going back like this. And, or you can stick it underneath some furniture like I just did. You saw that. Climb the rope to like there's a rope there. And slide down the rope. And slide back up. Or climb back up, I mean. 
and slide back down. Climb the rope and slide back down. Climb the rope and slide back down. That is very good. Or you can slide your hands and touch your heels of your feet, like me. Let's count to five. One, two, three, four, five. Very good. Now, I'd like to show you some push-ups now. And a lot of people have their hands like this when they do push-ups. And since you are a preschool child, you actually, your push-ups will be holding it up. See if you can hold your body up and see how long you can count to. Okay, go ahead and do it. See how long you can count to. longer every day you practice and that's how you get stronger you also can rock your your feet so you're rocking back and forth you will feel that working a lot of your abdomen and your stomach muscles right here um, another push-up as you know is to go all the way down but sometimes your hands can't allow you to do this anymore so instead of having it up like that, it's not straight, right? Straighten it out, make a fist and straighten it out so it's all in the same line. And then you can actually bend your knees and then you can go down and up. Down and up. Down and up. See if you can do, start with five or even start with three and then see if you can get up to 10. And remember, you gotta be patient it takes time to build up and get stronger. And another way to do push-ups is wall push-ups. So you put your hands on a wall, you go down and up. You bend down and you're just trying to push the wall and put all your weight on the wall. I love doing these ones too. These ones are really good because they work both sides of your arm. Very important, these are your biceps and these are your triceps. Now the last thing that we're going to do is some weight lifting for it. Now that we've warmed up and exercised somewhat of our, so our whole body is ready to do lifting exercises now. So you can get some cans like these. This is tomato, tomato sauce and green beans. You could get soup and they can be your weights. And I have some real weights like these. Let me show you different sizes that I have here. You probably don't want to get more than one or two pounds weights so that you could buy at Walmart if you wanted to. This is a different size and this is a different size. I'm just going to put those down so that I can do these with you. And we're just going to work our bicep, which is this part of our arm right here. Let's count to five. One, two, three, four, five. We just did five of them. That's just called, those are called repetitions or reps. But if we want to do five more, a, fi a group of five more, we did a group of five and we want to do a group of five more. That is a set. So let's do five more, which would be our second set. Ready? Of five repetitions. Ready? Go. One, two, three, four, five. Very good, you just did two sets of five, which is two sets of five repetitions. Now let's work our, the back part of our arm called the triceps because tri, like a tricycle, has three wheels. We have three muscles in the back here. So I'm just gonna go like this so that you can see me. You can even kneel down if you wanted to. So your arms are straight up and your elbows have to stay straight up and they're gonna almost be pointing to the ceiling. So that's one, let's do five again. Two, three, four, and 
done five. Good job. So we, we should probably do another set so that it's the same thing that we just did with our biceps. Okay, so let's do another, another set of five. One, two, three, four, and five. Good job. So we just did our biceps and our triceps. But what about the front of our arms here? We use our arms a lot. So you can hold one at the side or even back to kind of give it a stretch while you do just one arm like this, up and down, with a, your elbow is straight, or you could do both arms together. Should we count? Okay, let's count. One, two, three, four, five. And now let's do, we're supposed to rest before we do another set. We just kind of breathe and we just don't do the same exercise. That's a little bit of a rest. And then we can do it again. Let's do another set, ready? One, two, three, four, five. Good job, now how about we do some shoulder work, muscle work. So you're gonna go out with one arm. You might wanna do one arm at a time like this, or you could do both arms. It's almost like a butterfly, isn't it? Sure, there we go. And now, next video, we'll be stretching and some yoga. So I'm gonna stop that video. Oh, trying to stop the music there. Yay, if I can. And